I would like to go to call back to Order of Ecclesia. Today's a short episode, despite this being an actual dungeon instead of just a transitional area. Oh man, I'm not great this time. I don't know what it is. But I'm just not playing as good as I should. On the plus side, we're going to get an upgrade to our rapier. 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 Okay, here's a tip. Don't stand right up in their faces, because you can actually destroy their fireballs by standing a short distance away and attacking. Like I do there. Ugh. I get two text messages over the course of this video. Ugh. Oh, that gold ring is paying off. Too bad I use a lot of potions over the course of this video. Don't waste your hearts like that. Folks! How? You could have. Oh, I'm so not in my A game! <sighs> I need to come back here and grind for the blow ring. Which sounds hilarious, but it's actually pretty useful. Increases strike damage. Here, I want to know how much silk thread I still need. I need three more pieces. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. Oh yeah, I finally used those blue dots. I'm like, hey, hey, look, a thousand more points is always cool. I guess that is pretty cool. So, uh, Skeleton Heroes, uh, if you stand too close, they can actually whack you with their swords. But you can generally duck under their projectiles. I do like that you get the strike weapon before a dungeon filled with enemies weak to strike. Like, upgraded version of strike weapon, that is. Got a long range on that sword. Hmm. Hmm. Oh. I really like these guys at all. Oh man, they drop all those hearts because they did that back in Castlevania days, in like the olden games. And why let go of something that works just fine? So they apparently drop money if you're full on the hearts, if I remember. They drop money sometimes, at least. It's not it's a non-eligible amount of money, because, you know, it's like 20 coins, and if, if you get 10, it's still 200 gold you're getting. Though soon enough, money won't be a matter anymore, because we're going to pick up some really good stuff. We pick up that uh, R thing that gives us all the Benjamins. All the Benjamins. All the Benjamin. Also rapidly approaching the mo point where I run out of core knowledge and it becomes all new to me. So here I decide to grind Delahan's Vol Repier. Not the fucking Repier, man. Glyph Union doesn't change, so it doesn't show it off. Effective weapon doesn't change too much either. Oh man, that zero punctuation video is out, isn't it? Yeah. Yay, I get it early. Zoop. Full of rip here's now. It's as strong as, the, as this one, but it's faster. Now, it doesn't have that nice swinging arc, but the speed makes it... Oh, yeah, it's red, and it's got a little thing on the, the shaft. Or the, or the blade. Um, actually, that's one of my favorites. Ah, yes, yeah, Skeleton Rexes. They're very soft-looking, at least the heads are. Otherwise, they're actually not too bad if you have Lu if you have Luminatio. 
Because Luminacio has the giant benefit of that you don't have to stand around him too long. You just sort of attack and then walk away. Uh, this guy's a pain to hit. I sure it's powerful, but it's near impossible to hit the guy. Here I doof around more. You should just. Oh, this could have been so much better. If I just did the mace attack, I could have just stood there and done it. Oh. I'm not a big fan as to how projectiles work. No. I don't like that they vanish if you switch glyphs. MP up. I guess that the swapping has to do with, um... I don't know why they give you black drops. They're absolutely useless in this area, because everything's resistant to dark, anyway. I think the other three stats are poison... Another thing, and petrification. I don't know what the... Th uh, one of them is poison, and one of them is something else. I don't know what that other thing is, though. We'll find out eventually, but until then... Video's almost over, and I'll see you guys next time. Hope you enjoyed the video. Otherwise, whatever, next time, boss that I might fail a lot at. Whoops! Bye-bye. Hope you...